Hey, welcome back to Good Morning Vale. Joining me from Slifer Smith in Frampton, Jill Moneypenny. She's been a real estate agent with Slifer for 13 years. We were talking off camera, right? Yes, we are. And you came out here around the same time I moved to Vale, and we were talking about the Solaris location and really how much this place and how much the valley has grown and changed. It's been amazing, hasn't it? It has, absolutely. And it's nice to have you on the show. This is your first. Thank you, it is. Your first, first real estate interview. interview with us. And yeah. we get a lot of Slifer real estate agents with us. And I think there's some great turnaround with some of the properties. So hopefully we can showcase some of these beautiful properties today. And and I get people excited to come and visit. Absolutely. Right. Well, I know a lot of people are here, um, you know, from hotter areas of the country. And so I just wanted to pick some of my favorite hem hidden gems uh, to talk about this morning. All right. So we have photographs. We're going to start with, uh, you tell us about this first one. We'll pop up the photos and then you can tell us what everybody's looking at. Sure. So this is Bridgewater Terrace. It's a two bedroom, two bath on the river in Avon. Uh, comes with a one car garage. Uh, seriously, people don't know where this location is in Avon. So it's Bridgewater seriously Terrace. Is tell me where it is. Gym. Just kind of give me a hint. Yeah. So so um, it's on the Eagle River, um, a little bit west of the Weston on the walking path. Um, again, people uh, don't even know where it is. Good place. <laughs> Do you? <laughs> uh, river right out your back door. So you're kind of sandwiched between where the where the railroad tracks on that side, on the north side, right? Yep. Exactly. And then you've got you're kind of near the sanitation plant, that the water treatment area, kind of in that same area. So between the main entrance to Beaver Creek and the west entrance. Exactly. Okay. That, which makes it nice for people to walk across the street and ski. Nice and convenient for uh -huh. sure. Absolutely. And then how, what are we looking at pricing wise on that property? Do you know? So it's listed for 450000 Okay. Um, kind of an entry level right now. Uh, but I wanted to give you guys an example of different price points and availability through the valley. Okay. So let's bump up to our next one. Where are we going to go next? Sure. We're going to go to the Club Cottage on the ranch in Cordillera. Uh, this home is a five bedroom, six bath. Uh, looks out at the Hale Irwin Mountain Course. Um, okay. Let's see, again, another hidden gem, but then it's also just steps to the Timber Hearth Grill, which is open for lunch and dinner. Uh, they do sleigh rides in the winter. Um, Cordillera is just a magnificent place, true mountain living up there. It really is. When you turn off of Highway 6 and you start to go up Squaw Creek Drive and you're like, where are we going? This place is unbelievable. And it's a quick drive, quick access into the, into the community of Edwards, but it's still tucked away just far enough where you feel like you are very remote. It's wonderful up there. Absolutely. I have a lot of Texas clients who love being up there in the middle of the woods. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, Jill. So this is kind of the middle. Now, where are we going to go next then? We're going to Larkspur? Larkspur Villas. Okay. Yeah. So this is a newer listing. Um, this one is a six bedroom, seven bath. Wow. Um, it is um, seriously hidden. I mean, people don't even know about this street, uh, Larkspur Lane. Uh, they rarely come to market. This one's been remodeled uh, right across the street from Beaver Creek Village. Um, one of my favorite locations. Um, within, you know, Beaver Creek and everything that's going on there. So let me ask you this. Are these places all occupied right now? Are they Are available to be seen? They are available to be seen, but we do need a little bit of notice. And do you have any open houses coming up you want to let people know about? You know, I don't. Okay. Not at these homes okay. in particular, but I do have about two or three a week. Um, I've been working up in Beaver Creek quite a bit in the Village Walk area, which is also an epic place. And then your office, you're working out of Beaver Creek, so you're right there around the, the ice rink in the plaza. Absolutely. Yep, I'm okay. there at the uh, Park Hyatt in Beaver Creek. And then if people want to give you a call or check out your website, what's the best way to do that? Sure. So I'm at jillmoneypenny.com, okay. and uh, my number is 970-390-7643. job, Jill. You crushed it. Oh, you're so kind, Mark. Thanks give for having me. Give this lady a call and check out these beautiful <laughs> properties. And if there's other ones you want to see or other places around Eagle County, she can show them all to you today. All right, we're taking a quick break. Ashley has a look at that weather forecast. Then we're back to the Vail Farmer's Market.